Russia reports air raids for the first time since the beginning of the conflict with Ukraine on February 24th. Kremlin confirms that an oil depot in Russian city of Belgorod was hit and warned that aggression on Russian soil could derail peace talks. Moscow has alleged that the air raids were carried out by Ukrainian forces and released video of the purported attack in Belgorod, which lies 35 kilometers from the Ukrainian border. Russian oil firm Rosneft owns the depot, which was set ablaze by the airstrikes. Russia's defense ministry says two Ukrainian helicopters struck the facility, although Ukrainian foreign minister said he could not confirm or deny the same. Our following report tells you more. Russia accused Ukraine of carrying out an airstrike against a fuel depot in the Russian city of Belgorod on Friday, an incident the Kremlin said could jeopardize peace talks with Kiev. Ukraine's foreign minister, Dmitry Kuleba, said he could not confirm or deny the reports. The defense ministry and general staff did not respond immediately to requests for comment. Video footage of the purported attack, the first accusation of a Ukrainian airstrike on Russian soil since Moscow invaded Ukraine, showed what looked like several missiles being fired from low altitude, followed by an explosion. Reuters verified the location of the security camera footage as an area close to the fuel depot. It carries a timestamp that matches other reports online. Regional Governor Vyacheslav Gladkov posted on the Telegram messaging app that two Ukrainian helicopters struck the facility in Belgorod, about 22 miles from the border with Ukraine, after entering Russia at low altitude. The resulting blaze injured two workers, he said. But Russian oil firm Rosneft, which owns the depot, said no one was hurt. Uh, Kremlin spokesperson Dmitry Peskov said President Vladimir Putin had been briefed about the incident, which didn't create, quote, comfortable conditions for continuing the talks. Moscow calls its intervention in Ukraine a special military operation.